A box contains a number of red and green toys as shown in the table above. A toy can be either a disc or a ball. If a toy is chosen at random, what is the probability that it will be a green disc? In this table we have red toys and we have green toys. Further, the toy could be a ball or a disc. And we are asked to find the probability of a green disc. Now, the green disc is here. So we want this value divided by the total. This is because probability of an event is given as the number of desired ways of getting the required event divided by the total number of ways. Therefore, we want to find out this question mark divided by 20. Now, let's figure out this question mark. In this table, this is the grand total, 20. And this is 12. Therefore, this must be 8, because 8 plus 12 makes 20. Now we can find out the value of the question mark by using this logic. This plus question mark should be equal to 8. This in turn implies that the question mark must be 2. So we've got what we wanted. We can replace the question mark with 2 in our expression and write it like this. Now it can be reduced. Dividing by 2, we get 1 over 10. Thus, 1 over 10 is the probability of getting a green disk. Option C is correct. Thank you.